will be alright, sweetie. You're not gonna feel a thing, I promise. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Today, we're continuing our Disney Princess Illy mashup. I got this Made to Move Barbie on Amazon, which I found out that the first set of Made to Move Barbies are, like, readily available on Amazon. So, that's nice. However, now that I'm looking at her in person... I don't know about that, y'all. I don't know. It's weird because I feel like she matched. This one's looking a lot lighter than that one, though, isn't she? She matched this one pretty decently. I don't feel like she really matches this one super, super well either. She has a very interesting skin tone that's like in between. And the in betweens are the worst. But, anyways, I guess we'll go ahead and open her. I feel like she might match Ariel pretty well. She doesn't match Belle, and then we could just do a little bit of things. Oh, also, I actually do not have the fashion pack with me right now. I ordered it on Target because I won't have time to go get it this weekend, but it should be here this Friday. So, we're just, this is part one. It's all going to be one video, but this is just my part one, and then, yeah, we'll, we'll get it all together eventually. But in the meantime, we're just going to, like, swap her body, probably restyle her hair, and go from there. So let's just, let's just get this over with, shall we? Y'all, <laughs> what a flop. That is not even close. What is going on? I swear, that's not even the same, is it? Does it match Ariel? Um, well... Hmm. This is a predicament for sure. I am a. Uh, I'm gonna see some things. I'll be right back. Oh my gosh, that is so. Why is she so dark? She didn't used to be this. Cause this is the hiker one, and the hiker one was the same skin tone as this one at some point. What happened between back to this? This is not what she looked like in the picture on Amazon either, by the way. Matter of fact, I don't even think her head really matches. Does it? Mm, I guess so. Mm hmm. Well, <laughs> this really flops my little plans for the day because this is not, not going to work, like, at all. Wow. Well, back to the drawing board, I guess. All right, guys, it is the next day. And we are back with a new body. Thank you, Amazon. One day shipping. You come in handy so many times in my life. And I would just like to thank you for always being there. And the one thing I can rely on. Okay, let's see. All right. Let's rob her. All right. So once again, we have a match that is not... 100% perfect, but it's definitely passable. And even, I was looking at Ariel, because I was like, maybe I should just switch Ariel onto this body, but with Ariel, it'd be like the same. They look like they have the same skin tone, so not going to be much of a difference, and tracking down an uh, older batch body is going to be too much work. I didn't realize that the difference was that severe. Like, I knew there was a little bit of a difference, but Lord... That was crazy. I mean, like, this is not this. I just dropped something. But I found out that Aurora actually matches the new skin tone. So maybe you can stay. <laughs> I have an idea for Aurora. But anyways, uh, Belle's outfit is not going to be here till tomorrow. So this is the extent of what I'm doing today. I might go wash her hair real quick, but I'll do that off camera because it's, it's just washing hair. Y'all know what goes on. Y'all know what happens. Uh, but yeah, uh, I'll see y'all when the outfit comes. All right, let's go, girly. All right, guys, we are back. And once again, it is the next day. And now we have our outfit. Also, look how pretty her hair is. I just washed it. Um, she does have these weird little broken hairs, like, in the front, though, where her hair was pulled up. So that's a little interesting, for sure. But we'll do something to hide it, I guess. But look at this movement. I mean, like, stiff wear. Just that shine and the color. Oh, so gorgeous. So 
gorgeous. Anyways, let's take a look at her outfit. So here it is in the box. We have Inspired by Belle. Looks like they have the Tiana girl, who we named Lily, modeling it on the back. And here's the art. Oh, so cute. She looks so pretty. All right, so let's get it open. So this is one of my favorite pieces from this set. We have a little, like, wicker basket, a little picnic basket, with, like, some blue detailing and bows. And if we open it up, we have some food in there. It's all one piece, and it is some grapes, some apples, and some croissants. <laughs> Very delicious looking. And does this open on both sides? No, it just opens on the one side, and then you can just like stick it out. And yeah, it's so cute. I adore it. So the next thing we have is this little rose clip. The set actually comes with two of them, but I can't find the other one, and I just had it in front of me, and... Oh, I just took it out of frame because I'm still looking. I can't find it. I don't know where it went. But honestly, I'm not super concerned because they're both exactly the same. And I don't think I'm going to use them anyway. Like when I style her hair. So, because I don't like, this is the same issue I have with the Snow White clip. I don't like how the plastic like bends and creases like that. Uh, that's not cute for me. The next thing we have is this cute little double layered chain necklace with a rose. Or actually two roses on there. One just is like has a stem. I actually have like a Beauty and the Beast necklace for myself that has a rose similar to this, so that's really cute. And it was a chain too, it was from Hot Topic. For shoes, we have these very cute blue, navy blue combat boots with a rose print all around them with some brown beige soles and there's a little tag sticking out at the end. Now these, I think I can get away with putting on a made to move body because it's a boot, so. Let's hope. And then we have the denim, which is made from a real, well, at least real feeling denim. We have some rose decals on them. Also, if you didn't like these rose decals and you just wanted a pair of denim, you could take some acetone and totally just wipe it off. Oh, that's... Okay. And then you could have a plain pair of denim. So yeah, they're cuffed at the bottom. There's a little stud for the button right here. And they look nice. And then our last piece is this like satiny. It's so soft. I'm actually like shocked at how soft it is. I thought it was going to be papery in person, but it does not feel papery at all. It's made from a really nice material and it's yellow with a rose print. And there is some ruffles at the top and the bottom of the shirt. And here it's like a peasant top. It's like a peasant top. It's giving very fearless, you know, very very that we love it all right y'all here is Belle fully styled as anticipated i was able to get the shoes they stay on pretty well uh her hair i gave her these little tendrils in the front i did end up using both hair clips i found the other one and i did like this half up half down thing except that the ponytail is a french braid i might fix that a little bit and tighten it up i want to do a whole braid but this like layering looked really dumb when it was in a full braid so yeah but this is not as tight as i would like it to be so it kind of like sticks out on the sides just a little bit and i don't really care for that but the top looks nice and the hair clips actually ended up working I spent forever trying to find the second one i don't know how it just like disappeared but it just like randomly showed up and i love this top so much oh it's very much giving everything it needs to be giving and she is just so gorgeous so yeah we're done with our restyle if you enjoyed it make sure to leave a comment down below and tell me so i love seeing comments let me know oh wait i just told you to do that uh and you know if you enjoy the content make sure to subscribe and follow my socials and i will see you guys next time bye